Hey, so welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my 10th week hair video. Holy cow. She is wild. She is officially a mullet. You guys, I'm not kidding. Due to this whole COVID-19 thing, um, I was I was actually gonna, I bought a cute little turbid headband to hide all this, but unfortunately I can't. I have to wear my face mask at work. So, so I can't, I can't really hide this hot mess. She is officially a mullet, literally you guys, like I just got out of the shower. So if we brush her forward, literally, this is how long my top is. I look like one of those Asian kids that has like that really bad bowl haircut. You know, when you put like a bowl around your head and your parents cut it and you take it off, that's that's what this looks like. Back here is no longer standing up. It is officially like laying flat. Like she laying flat. Um, over here, like the sides, obviously like my sides and my sideburns are getting really thick. Um, my hair is like literally almost over my, like it's like right here by my top of my cartilage, by my cartilage. So <sighs> this is crazy this is so crazy like I said in my eighth week video um that I would do like a weekly thing but due to me going back to work I think I'm gonna do it like eight week no seven weeks this is ten weeks so I'm gonna just like slowly <laughs> not film as much but yeah she 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 getting very like untamable um the thing that i've been doing i'm still doing i'm actually taking my vitamins obviously the vitamins that i do take is for the hair skin and nails because your girl got her nails back and i noticed my skin is actually clearing up with these vitamins which i'm very forever grateful for um they look like this one. Ooh, ooh. Oh, sheesh, sheesh, sis, this one, <laughs> that was bright. So this is the vitamins that I take. I never took vitamins before, so there wasn't any growth in my hair. Um, I notice my hair now, like when it's dry, what I've been doing now is I go in the back and I like give myself a nice like head massage, just a so relaxing. And um, see, and the brush that I've been using is actually a wet brush. Um, what prior to this, like I never dried, I never brushed my hair because I've always had short hair, so I could just towel dry it and be done with it. Now she gotta get brushed. So the brush I use is a small wet brush detangler. Um, it's very small it's like the mini ones that are like this so oh this one but it's smaller so I have that and um, what I do is I tend to like what I do works for me so whatever works for you guys please do I just grab all the hair like I get out of the shower and first thing I do when I get out of the shower is I grab my hands and I just go forward with it. I just get out of the shower, forward, and I go in the back, and I look like a wet dog. <laughs> and then I'm like, okay, Chrissy. So I just grab my brush, brush it all forward, and then it's all forward, and then I just slowly just make sure everything is in place. And then put the brush away and then I just go over my ears you know just make sure everything is intact grab it back so yes that's what I've been doing um, the shampoo I use is from Regis I can't remember what it's called though let's let's, let's just go look up it's an orange bottle um, smells really good Regis salon um 
Uh, we are looking, we're looking for the shampoo because I buy mine from Regis products. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, what do you start with? I can't remember. Oh, it is Amika. That's how you say it. It's the signature conditioning, the conditioner, and the um, shampoo. I tend to like if I go out if I go out obviously with the whole COVID-19 I come home and I wash my hair I shampoo my hair and meantime while I shampooing I'm making sure I give myself a scalp massage so I start from back here and I work it up and so that's when you're shampooing I rinse it I put conditioner and I do the same thing and that's what I notice the difference too is when I do that this like actually grows. It's been growing. It's weird. So I'll be working for the next five days. So obviously I'll be in the public. So I have to come home and wash my hair. Um, I know that everybody says, Chrissy, if you're home, don't wash your hair. Um, I've been going out for the past two days. So I didn't wash my hair Monday and it, it's been growing. It's been growing. Um, I do notice a little difference. I don't have dry scalp anymore. Like my dandruff, isn't as bad has it been when I had short hair I guess because it's starting to grow out longer and I'm starting to like massage my scalp more making sure my hair breathes but if I'm off I tend to use um, coconut oil in my hair so if I'm in the shower shaving my legs I will put coconut oil in my hair so when I put coconut oil in my hair I do the same thing that I do when I wash my hair start from my back here work my way up and once I get to the top I just start massaging going like this with my fingers making sure everything and every hair follicle or hair piece or whatever you would call your hair that it's has some oil in it some nice stuff in it that it's soaked up in there um, I leave it in for 15 minutes and then I wash my hair so that's what I've been noticing a lot with this hair <laughs> Hair. she is a little thick not gonna lie um that's like I said I'm Filipino I'm Japanese so and Hawaiian so she, she she heavy and she thick so yes you guys I can't wait to see what it's gonna look like next month because it's June it's summer and it's starting to get hot so may I remind you guys I haven't had a haircut since March 22nd and this is it may 27th so she getting long um i did tell my family that i'm growing up my hair so they're excited i've had short hair for six years and look at lie, you guys short hair is badass chrissy um with the head my short hair i could rock it i was a badass i could kick butt and now that it's actually growing i have no idea how long hair chrissy is gonna be or like hair up to here chrissy is gonna be um kind of nervous <laughs> but we will definitely see um so yeah if you guys want to come along with this hair journey with me please give this video a thumbs up comment down below what you guys did to grow out your mullet because right now with COVID-19 I am I can't wear a hat to work I can't wear a beanie to work and I can't wear my cute headband that I bought to work because it covers my ears so pretty much you're just gonna see this if I wear it like this like this just just think you guys would just be seeing this and that's what I wanted to do to like hide the whole mullet thing but I have to wear my mask at work so mask first hair second so yes you guys so if you guys have any comments tips anything to get over this ugly mullet stage let me know I will see you guys in week maybe 14 14 or 15 okay bye guys